Yeah. Uh, my name is Phil Ade, young hip hop artist from the DC, Maryland, Virginia area, more specifically Maryland. Yeah. I'm signed to 368 Music Group. This is Raheem Devon, Dre the Mel Hobson label, you know, DC based label, independent. So, so how's it feel to release your uh, third mixtape? Um, feels good, man. It feels good a lot, a lot. I think like with each project that we drop, a lot more work goes into getting it, you know what I mean, produced and, and putting it out there. So I mean, I like, I really took a deep breath after this one because it was like it was a lot of stress, a lot of late nights, a lot of tears, and you know all that going back and forth. Like it's crazy, man, putting this together. So definitely feels good to have this. At this project out. How does it feel to be mentioned as one of the best in the DMV? Man, that's crazy. It's, you know, this is an area on the upstart. Like it's not, it's not really on it as far as having a national, a national having national attention as far as a, a strong area of hip hop. So I mean, it really feels good to be, you know, I guess one of the artists pioneering, you know, the whole hip hop movement out here. What is um your goal basically in this um, hip hop? What I what I want to bring to the music game is just you know just fun music you know music about life about regular situations you know not everyone has a Bentley not everybody you know what I'm saying has a house on the hill and has a bunch of rings and jewelry you know there's, there's dudes just out just out here just like me you know that go to school that you know they have uh, parent problems with their parents and. I just want to cover all that and bring it to attention, man. I think that's the best way to connect with people, is telling real stories. What do you say about uh, DMV artists right now? Uh, you know, Wale, Fat Trail, um, Black O'Bain. DC, DC area is a, is a place with a lot of talent. Like, I'm definitely not the only one out here. This, like, you guys kind of on the rise right now, you yeah, think? No, nah, yeah, for sure. There's so much talent out here. Trail is, is another one. I think he's going to do well. See, I think he showed brings another side of DC out that we haven't seen yet. Uh, of course, Black Cobain, dope artist, and he's from VA too. That's another, you know what I'm saying? That's another piece in the DMV that we haven't really seen yet. So that's dope. There's definitely a lot of talent out here that has still been uh, undiscovered. Logic too from Maryland. Uh, speak about um, pursuing your dreams instead of uh, going to college. Oh man, it's definitely like. Like, in order to do this, like, you really gotta have passion for it, like, which is kind of passion. Like, in order to pursue a, a career in music, like, you really gotta have a passion for it and a love for it. You gotta have drive for it, because, I mean, it's not easy, man. You, you, you're doing this for a long time before you start seeing any real money from doing it and, and be actually be able to support yourself doing it. So you definitely have to have a passion for it. Um, it was a little trouble for me, you know, my parents are not too fond of hip-hop music, so, you know, I left the, left the crib, you know, when I was 20 years old, moved in with my, um, my manager, but, it, you know, it's been going well for me, and, and I'm, I'm about to be where I need to be, so. Who would you like to work with? Who else would I like to work with? Man. Um, what do you mean, as far as, just anybody? Anybody. I think I would like to work with Q-Tip. Tribe Quest, you know, and just some of the beats that Q-Tip has made, and the whole vibe, like, like that's just me. I know you signed with uh, Raheem Devon's label, uh, 368. Yep. Um, are you looking for any other deals or? I mean, all right now we just we just trying to ride it out on our own. You know, the game is such that you can do it by yourself. It's possible. Like, just going on tour with Mac not too long ago, just seeing him. He's, Independent, trying to rostrum records, which is not a major label, it's an independent label. And he's selling out 930, selling out big theaters. He's doing it by himself. He's about to put out an album too. So, I mean, we're just really trying to, you know, ride it out by ourselves, see how it goes. But, I mean, if the right situation presents itself, of course, we're going to be down. When do you think uh, we'll see an album from you? When you see an album from me? Man, real talk. I mean, yeah. The last project I put out, I consider an album. You know, it was free, but you know, we went about it like an album. It's all original music. Um, a lot of time and effort put into it. So, but as far as an album for sale, you know, 
I, I can't really say. I'm not sure. But it's gonna be soon. I'll tell you that. Right, I'm done. Nah, I ain't trying to talk shit. We've been doing that way too.